Today, I'll be building the draft, but I can only select the player if I score a penalty with them. So for this pick, I'm going to choose Michael Owen, and all I have to do is score a penalty with him. Michael Owen steps up, top left-hand corner, and he scores. So now I can choose Michael Owen, and he comes straight into the team. And I'll be doing this for every single pick. Next up is the centre midfielder. Do we have Ericsson, Parejo, or Sergio Roberto? I feel like we should go with Ericsson. He's in the Premier League, and he's also the highest rated. Ericsson only has 75 penalties. This should be fun. To make things even more difficult, the goalkeeper is a 99 rated and I need to score with Ericsson otherwise he can't come into the team. I'm going to go top left again. Come on! So far so good. We've got two out of two but I feel like the defenders aren't going to have the best penalty. So I'm going to go to the centre back next. Please give me a Sergio Ramos. He's the only defender I know that has good penalties. Oh my god. Team of the year Ruben Diaz. 95 rated as our first pick in defence as well. You know who I'm going to select. Please I need Diaz in my draft. I'm just going to tap it down the middle and hopefully the goalkeeper dives. No! Oh, God. As I failed to score with Diaz, I don't get to select him. So we go to the next player in the list, which is Rafael Varane. If we miss this, we're in trouble. I'm just going to put one bar of power and go bottom left corner. Just please score Varane. Thank you. That is a terrible penalty, by the way. It looks like I'm taking Varane, but that Ruben Diaz, oh, he looks so nice. Let's go to the subs bench for our next pick. And we are going to get, ooh, quite a few good options. Obviously, the first player that I'm going to try and take is Messi. It's not quite the team of the year, but the 92 rated will do the job. I'm so confident this is going to go in. I'm going to do a little penenka, top left-hand corner. Messi! And there we go. Messi's in the team. And so far, we've only missed one penalty out of four. But got a feeling that might not continue. I'm honestly really scared for these centre-backs, especially after Ruben Diaz missed. So let's get the next centre-back next to Rafael Varane. Please be someone good. Oh, wow. I actually don't know who to pick. <laughs> this is so hard. Who has the best penalty? 76. 94 penalties on Bright. Araujo has 45. Oh, I won't be selecting him. Does Maldini have good penalties? No. 56. Does Van Dijk have good penalties? No. 65. I don't know who to choose. Even though Van Dijk is the best centre-back in the game, I want to get my first team of the year in the squad. So I'm going to try my luck and get 95 rated Renard. I am not missing out on another team of the year. It is not happening. Not today. Let's go. Now, getting 95 rated Renard is very important because at the end of the video, if I don't hit an 87 rated squad with 25 team chemistry, I have to discard the most expensive player in the team. And at the moment, that's Renard as she's 2.7 million coins. The team's actually not looking too bad right now. Can we get a good winger? Oh, we have a few good options here. Grinch and Dembele. Because we're working towards the 87 rated squad, I need all the help I can get. And the 93 would be pretty nice. I couldn't find Grincha at all in the arena. So we have came to the biggest stage of them all. A penalty shootout and he has to score because I really need him in my team. He's missed. Oh, Garincha. Instead of going with Dembele for our second pick, I've decided that Saka is going to be our player. Bottom left. He's saved it as well. This is not going to plan at all. You know what they say? Third time lucky. And why is Dembele really like that? Isn't he left footed? Oh, that makes sense. Top right. <laughs> a penalty it's not a bad player to have in the team because he is french and he also helps out with chemistry however we are now chasing three ratings that we lost by missing the penalty of Grincha. i actually completely forgot about messi on the bench so if we select the center forward neck and they're terrible guess what messi comes into the starting 11 so let's find out maybe an r9 or a pele would do Ooh, we have the choice of three icons Cantona, zola or puskas oh this one is a tricky one to choose from you know what i'm gonna have to go with the highest rated player which is puskas i don't want to do it but i have to do it because i don't want to discard anyone especially millions and millions of coins so come on then puskas let's see what you got again same as garincha he's not in the arena so back to a penalty shootout garincha didn't score puskas though can you do what he couldn't who's the better icon you or him. Bottom right corner. Full power. Hoo -hoo, the keeper's not saving that one, is he? Come on. Puskas now is officially a better icon than Grincha. If you're enjoying the video so far, smash a like and make sure to subscribe. Next up is the goalkeeper, Van Nistelrooy. I actually don't know how good he is at saving penalties. Come on, Van Nistelrooy. You can do this. I need you. I need you 91 rated. No, he's missed it. Next up is our second selection, Edwin Van der Sar. He's going to go right. Nope, that's two in a row. I've not saved. I'm going to try out Herideki, but no, my luck, I probably won't save it again. We are down to our third choice, Herideki versus Tavernier, left hand side. I'm not even celebrating that because we didn't get who I wanted, so let's just move on. He's in the team, and so far, I feel like it looks okay. I just don't think it's great. So our centre mid next better be a team of the year or an icon the game can hear me EA please give me really good pat look I want Arnon Ronaldo and Pele in my next pack because it's De Bruyne I'm just gonna go top corner and even though it's a 99 rate goalkeeper 
he ain't gonna be able to save it. Oh, the power on that was ridiculous. I'm glad I scored because the next player I would have chosen is Pedri and he's a 90 rated and we don't want that. So PDB, get in my team. You are not going anywhere. Can we get back to back team of the years? Maybe. Javi Alonso is not too bad. The things he's doing with Leverkusen, I don't think they've lost in the league this year. And he's also linked to the Liverpool job once Klopp leaves. Or Emmanuel Petit, who's French and helps out with chemistry a lot. So if I put him there, we get 26 chemistry. Alonso only 24. Do I go with rating or do we go with chemistry? I'm going to go with rating. KDB put in the top corner. So Alonso, you have to do the same. A lot of power. Oh, maybe that's too much. Top left. Oh, I actually think that was better than Kevin De Bruyne's penalty. That was absolutely outrageous, Alonso. What I've just realised is that we've done nine out of the 11 Stein players already, and only one player on the bench, which is Messi. And he feels all alone. And he just said to me, Spencer, can you go and get me another player on the bench? No problem. No problem. I can do that for you. Oh, it's a team of the year. This draft so far has been so good. Every single pick, the players have been very usable and not any 75 rated players because otherwise we'd have a problem so far. Team of the year, Frimpong. He would look lovely next to Renard. This version of Frimpong only has 39 penalties. So the smart thing to do was just to be tap it, bottom right hand corner, and maybe the keeper goes that way. Let's move on. For the next pick, I'm going to go for 87 rated Masrori. I don't think he's going to get into the team. I don't think anyone else is, so he's going to just go off the bench. Do you know what? For this one, I tapped it with Frimpong. I'm just going to rocket this. Put so much power on. He either misses it or he goes in, or the keeper saves it. Kieran Trippier, can you do any better? You actually have 66 pens, which is more than Masrori and Frimpong. Come on, finally scored a penalty with a defender. Trippier goes on the bench. My team rate at the moment is 86, but I can come straight down if we key game players like Trippier. Next player on the bench is going to be... Oh, God, that's awful. This is exactly what I'm saying. If we key game these like rated players, it's already going to go one way. So we're going to have to try and get Pedro in. I just want to score this and move on to the next player. Let's go. Best of a bad bunch. Come on, let's get another one. Let's get a team of the year. What is it with these terrible picks? I've jinxed it. Ever since I said this draft was really good, my picks have been terrible. Ugh, okay, so let's go. There's not much risk. If I miss this, I have another chance to get an 84 rated player. So I'm going to try a little Penenka. Keeper had no chance. That bench so far has not been good to me. So I'm going to go to reserves and hopefully we can change that up with a team leader or an icon. Ooh, Salah. Come on, please. That one up needs a goal. Come on. The keeper had no chance. 99 rated, but it's Mohamed Salah. Put some respect on his name. Honestly, if I missed out with Salah, we was in big trouble because the next highest rated is 84. And I do not want that for my team. I'm going to go and get another reserve player because Salah paid off. And I feel like there might be some more gems hidden behind these selections. I actually don't know what I need other than high rate that is awful. As they're not going to affect the team rating or chemistry, they're definitely not going to start in the 11 or the subs. They're going to stay in the reserve. And for that reason, I'm not even going to bother taking a penalty run because they're absolutely terrible. Please redeem yourself, reserves, because that was awful. Come on, please. Oh, ho, ho, ho. This is massive. If I don't score with Hansen, I have to go from a 97 rated to an 84. This is definitely the biggest penalty so far. She's one rating higher than Kevin De Bruyne. And De Bruyne did put it in the top corner. Can you do it, Hansen? Oh, the keeper actually tried to dive as well, but they just stopped halfway through because it was such a good penalty. Thank God we didn't miss that. How many team years is that in the squad now? We've got one, two, three. Oh, actually, can I put... Oh, it takes one chemistry point away. The rating doesn't go up. Please. Hey! 87 rated. Time to go back into the star 11 and get our first fullback on the right hand side. Oh, Avenir. Oh, actually, yeah, he has 99 penalties. I forgot about that. Oh, this should be easy. Why is the circle thing so quick? I thought if you had better penalties, it was lower and easier. There we go. Good timing, though. Top right. Lovely. Who's this? Ah. Hello? Yes, I've already hit an 88 rated squad. I do have a few more players to select as well. Yes. No, that's not fair. Come on. Really? Fine. I've just been told by the boss that the target rating has been updated. Currently, it's 87 I have to hit, which I have. Now, it's 90. And if I don't get it, I still have to discard the most valuable player in my team, which is Hanson, who's 8 million coins. Every pick now is really important. I need high rated players. That is not high rated enough. Oh. I'm going to have to try and get Caramo. Is that how you pronounce it? Caramo? I don't know. He looks good, though. Just not 90 plus rated. Let's start off a scoring streak so we can get the highest rated players. First one up, Caramo. Come on. There's one. Thank God. In he goes. And we still need some more bench players. Next up, though, is the goalkeeper. I'm not even going into a penalty shootout. I'm just going to go and select Dimi... Dimitrievsky? Dimitres... Dimi... Dimitrievsky. Dimitrievsky. I think that's correct anyway. Welcome. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this next spot on the subs bench is always a defender. Centre-back or a full-back? Please be Van Dyke, team of the year. 
This is not good. Because there's a big rating difference between the three of them, and it could affect the overall result. I still have to go and try and score a penalty with the marker. What's these penalties? I bet you they're terrible. 66 penalties. Let's step up. Oh, that's very quick. Top corner. There's two in a row. I'm going to select Marco and replace him with the reserve Chiesa. It doesn't do anything, but still have hope. Let's go and get our last reserves player. The team of the year and icon would be perfect right now. Ooh. Gakpo, I know you're not in the starting 11, but please, I need you to do me a favor and put the ball in the back of the net. Yes, let's go. Three in a row. If I miss that with Gakpo, I think that might have been the video over. The rating would have been out of sight, but we still have a chance. Two more to go, one subs and one left back. This left back needs to be Timmy Theo Hernandez, Icon Bro, Carlos, anybody who's just unbelievable. Please, please, EA. 86 rated. I need higher. Who do I go for, though? I'm going to go for Emerson as he's the only special card out of these five. Time to make it four in a row, Emerson. That's actually a lot of power, but not enough for the goalkeeper. Next up is Batcher. Rating wise, it won't make any difference because Batcher and Emerson are exactly the same rating. Oh, well, I've missed. Now, it does make a difference because now we're going down to an 85, which is Leo Hernandez. This is just going painfully. Hernandez, let's not make things any worse. Please just put the ball in the back of the net. Thank you. Me going down to an 85 rating better not affect the chemistry. Let's find out. Ooh, we're on 89 rating with one more to go. My team keep moving around. The amount of times I've moved Hanson and she keeps going back to reserves. We'll figure it out at the end. Let me take the last player pick and then we can mess around with the team and hopefully we can get the rating. Come on. This is it. The last one of the draft. Are you telling me the last pick to get a 90 rated team, I'm getting a 77 rated? It's not even worth taking a penalty, is it? If I have to go and buy Hanson for 8 million coins and discard her because of this one individual pick, I am never playing draft ever again. I'm just going to go and select this player because it's not going to make any difference whatsoever to the team. Still 89 rated. So this is it. I have to go and mess around with the team, put Hanson in the starting 11, move around the bench players. And if I don't get a 90 rated team, we're in big trouble. I did it! I got a 90 team rated and 29 team chemistry. I honestly thought I couldn't do it. I thought we were stuck at 89. Oh, let's go. If you enjoyed me doing this draft, make sure to like, subscribe to the channel and give this video a watch because YouTube thinks you'll like it.